Hello, hello. Hello. Good evening. Good evening. It's been a pleasure to have you here, girls. So it's going to be Claudia <laughs> and Maria del Carmen. That's amazing. And the teacher, of course, right? So it will be a girls' night. That's amazing. I love it. There you go. <laughs> How's your journey going so far? Is it good? Yes. Okay. What did you do? I'm just um, cleaning my house and mm -hmm. laundering my clothes. All right. And I slept in sleep. <laughs> in the sleep. Oh, but that's amazing. That was a pretty nice day, by the way. So you did like a house chores, okay? House chores. House okay. chores, exactly. When you clean your house, when you mop the floor, uh, yeah, when you like swept or when you do everything related to a uh, dedicated some time to your house, when you do the laundry, for example, or iron your clothes, that's what we call house chores, okay? House chores. House okay, chores. Thank you. Your model working. All righty. What about you, Claudie? What did you do today? Hi, Claudia. How are you? <laughs> Hi, teacher. Hey, I said Claudia. That's why maybe you said, who is she talking about? <laughs> All right, sorry. <laughs> I have a friend of mine. It's really close to a friend. Her name is Claudia. And I call her Claudia, right? So sometimes it's like, Whoa. well, she understands me, right? Because she speaks English as well. But uh, I, guess I said, okay, better say Claudia because she's not, she's not going to understand what am I talking about. Okay, so Claudia, tell me, how is your day going so far? How was your good. day? It's good. What did you do actually? Yeah. Uh, actually, I start English class. Yes, today. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, like, oh today my God, that's I, the first day in my class. Yeah, really? That's good. Yes. Okay, so that's good. Uh, you know that I'm the teacher who always asks a lot of questions. Yeah, and I will always start uh, with how was your day because I want you guys to practice the simple past all the time, okay? Sometimes okay. we tend it up to confuse and uh, because sometimes we mix it up the present, the past, and the future, but, uh, and, oh, you forgot uh, how to say like certain verb that is for uh, right regular verb or verbs that are regular. So, no, we need to practice. Okay, okay, practice makes perfection. So tell me, what did you do? I went to my work. Oh, you went to work. So you, you don't work from home. You go to the site. Uh, outside. Tomorrow, oh. I work with my home. Uh, at home. Tomorrow yes. will be at home. But today, you work uh, outside. Outside, yes. Mm, okay. So basically, it was one day at home and one day outside or no? How it works, yeah? Yes. Oh, that's yes. good. Where do you work? I work EPR. EPR? Is, yes, is energy distribution. distribution. Oh, yeah, distribution. distribution. Ah, okay, that's nice. Okay. That's interesting. Are you an engineer or something like that? No? I don't know. No, no, no. no, no, no. Okay. No. I am an accounting. You're an accountant. You are an yes. accountant. So you work for accounting props. Yes. An accounting department. So that's nice. Ooh. You love numbers, right? <laughs> I hate them. Yes. But, but I have to work with them, so... Yes, because I'm kind of like that, but I'm not. <laughs> I work with cleans, actually. <laughs> yes, so I know what it is. Oh, but it, was it good your day? Was it good? Yes, it's yeah. good. Okay, cool. Uh, at what time did you end up your shift today? Do you understand what I'm talking ended about? Up. And, and, no, ended up. That means no. you start working. At 8 a.m., for example, right? And at what time ah, do you okay. finish your work? Okay. Today. My my shift is from mm -hmm. 7, 7 a. 7 a.m., yeah? Until? 5 p.m. Hey, do you, you have the same shift as I. 5 p.m. <laughs> really? From 7 a.m. to 5 p.m., okay. <laughs> Monday to Friday, weekends off? Friday... It's 
3 p.m. Oh, from 7 to 3. Oh, okay, that's good. Yes. Do you work at weekends? Or no. No. Yes. Me too. Neither only I, only Monday and Friday. So only Monday to Friday. Okay, very good. Yes. Who's sleeping, by the way? Who's sleeping? Miss Hala Mercedes, don't fall asleep. Ha! Huh. No, it was not me. <laughs> One. Yeah, I heard it was like a, uh, no way. Not with me. Oh, it was Fernando, by the way. No. Was it <laughs> you, Fernando? <laughs> Hello, teacher. Hello. Hopefully not, right? Huh, huh. <laughs> yeah. Tell me, guys. Today is Monday. Yeah, what's up? In the Congo, it's raining hard, teacher, for is the morning. Raining? Really? Yes. Here, no. It started, it started like 6 p.m. Oh my God, since 6 p.m. in the afternoon, it's still raining? Yes. Wow, wow, wow. So almost two hours, right? Yes, teacher. Oh my goodness. Here, no, but it is really hot right now. So I think that uh, later on at night, it will start raining, hopefully, because it's, <laughs> it's really hot right now. And I know good okay. with hot weather, yes. Okay, very good. Tell me, guys. What do you do on weekend? How was your weekend? Hey, Ronaldo Umberto, how was your weekend, by the way? How was your weekend? We cannot hear you. I cannot hear you right now. Really? Yes. It's oops. You know, I was like, yes, it's much better now. So thank you, sir. <laughs> <laughs> it was great. Thanks. I went to the beach with some friends. <laughs> no, that's not possible. Yeah, teacher. Really? Oh my God. I share some time with them. That's amazing. Yeah. That was really good. So you went uh, to the beach with some friends. Which yeah. beach, by the way? Uh, have you ever heard about Chalpa? Nope, never before. The, that that is the, the a, a, a good beach. Where is it located? Uh, maybe thirty kil kilometers. Kilometers, uh, yeah. Af uh, after el, el Tunco. After el Tunco. Ah, okay. Yeah. So it's nearby. So it's in the Libertad right now. Yeah. Oh, that's yeah. great. Oh, okay. Listen carefully, okay, because you need to pay attention to what your uh, classmates are uh, are telling or saying. Okay, thank you. Who else wants to participate? Um, Melvin, what about you? Hello, how are you? Good evening. Good evening, sir. It's been a pleasure. Yes, well, I can tell you, well, uh, Saturday I am resting part of the day. That's good. I'm cleaning, cleaning my house. You cleaned and wash, your house. Cleaned my house, washed, uh, washed clothes. Okay. And I slept uh, a time in the, in the afternoon. That's great. You deserve it. And Sunday, go to went to see my mother. Okay. I uh, I don't you, I you don't visit see. your mama. Yes, yeah, I visit my mom, my mm -hmm. mother. Uh, a time in a meet in uh, in the noon on Sunday. Mm -hmm. After go back to my go went back to my house. So you came back home. You came back came, home. Came back home mm -hmm. to see to to make to make lunch. Uh, to prepare my, lunch. To my, prepare. my 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 famous beans soup. Really? Okay. May, maybe sometimes here in the class we will have like um. Oh well, in the last course, right, Melvin? I think yes. so. Yeah, we have this option to prepare, right? Yes. Mm -hmm. Yes. Yeah, but don't worry. We're going to put in practice this course as well. Okay. So you can give your recipe, which I think it sounds and tastes really good. Isn't it? Okay. With uh, mm -hmm. pork milk, pork, well, pork, pork beef, milk, beef, po beef, pork mm -hmm. beef with or pork meat. pig, vegetables, vegetables. Our our famous loroco. Oh really, loroco? 
Yes. In a bean soup. Oh, that's interesting. Okay. Yes. What else? Yes. Because I already I have all, only tried it with a rocco with a chicken soup, right? Or okay. with a hand soup. That means a gadina, hand soup, right? Yes. That yes. no with bean soup. Yes. That yes. Actually, it's interesting soup, right now. Okay. Bean soup with avocado and cheese. With avocado fresh and cheese. cheese and fresh avocado cheese. Avocado and fresh cheese. All right. That's amazing. Does it sound interesting, guys? Would you like to try Mr. Melvin's uh, beans recipe, by the way? <laughs> Noemi, what do you think? Oh, this top secret. Adela, you are really, you are a really great chef. I know that. So would you like to try his recipe, by the way? It sounds good, right? Interesting, I think. What do you think, Noemi? Uh, for the recipe, oh. Mm -hmm. Or Mr. I, yeah, Melvin's a uh, bean soup. Maybe I like to to try to taste different food. Exactly, if uh, something new, right? Different something recipe. new. Yeah, mm -hmm. just in case you need to, you can go to the drugstore to buy some medication, right? <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding, Melvin. <laughs> no, no, just kidding. No. All, fa all my family is okay. Oh, yeah, I know, I know. I'm just kidding. I'm just teasing you. You know what teasing you is? No. When you're kidding, when you are joking, <laughs> ah, okay. it's because you're you're joking with everybody, right? Ah, okay. But if you are joking with one person in a specific, in this case, Melvin, you said, I'm teasing you. Okay? okay? Because I'm joking just with him. You all right? Can you write it on the chat, please? No. <laughs> 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 yeah, I will, I will. I will send it to you in a minute. Okay, don't worry. I'm teasing you. Okay, okay. we'll write it now, right now. Okay, tell me who else? Uh, Patricia, what about you? Tell me. What did you do today? Oh, well, Hello, on the weekend. Teacher. Hello, on the weekend, what did you do? Um, I'm say, I'm say, very sick and very sick why what happened with my uh, throat oh okay you got a sore throat problems throat problems okay oh, i'm sorry to um, hear that really uh, when did it start stay in my house hmm? okay you stayed home mm -hmm. i stay my in my home and descansar no sé cómo se dice take a rest Take a rest. Mm -hmm. um, Watching TV or read. Um, Watch TV? Okay. Read the, the, a book. I watch the movies. Okay. What um, else did you do? What? What else will you do? Nothing else? Did you no, do something else? Some... Did you do something else? Oh, yes. Only. Only. Oh, my God. I'm sorry to hear that, you know. I'm sorry to hear you. Okay. Because, because I know that it's not uh, easy or great to feel bad. Yes. Right? I know. Oh, my God. But do you feel much better? Uh, no. No? Oh, but I'm so happy that even though you are, you do not feel good, you are here in the class. I don't understand is the finish. No, no, no. I'm, I'm happy because okay. you don't feel good right now, but okay. you are here in class. Okay. So Thank I'm you. happy to see you. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you. So I'm not going to ask you much, right? So you can like raise your throat a little bit. Okay. Okay. There you Thank go. You. So she has a sore throat, sore throat, sore throat problem. Okay. I wrote it already, Ronald. Yeah, okay. I got it. Yeah, okay, Thanks. cool. You're welcome. All righty, who else wants to participate? Uh -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh. Hey, Christian, very good. I miss you from Friday. What happened? You were here, but you were not there. So what happened? <laughs> Hi, Christian, how are you? Hi, teacher. Hi. Um, my weekend was very good. Really? What I, happened? I wa I washed my car. I okay. washed you, my car. You washed your car. 
I went okay. to play soccer oh, okay. with friends. Oh, that's nice. Near your house, by the way? Yes. Oh, that's great. Mm -hmm. yeah, I I take this this reset. I take reset. Uh, you took? I take reset. You, you took some time off? Yes. Okay, yes, of course. Day you off, deserve yes. it. On day off, yes, you, you deserve it. Like Melvin, yes. yes. Mm -hmm. Only. That's, but that was really good, actually. Okay, I want to know what was uh, this person weekend. I thought it was really interesting. Adela, how are you, my beautiful woman? How are you? Hmm? How was your weekend? Oh, I cannot hear you, Adela. Sorry. I cannot hear you. Mm -mm. I cannot hear you. Can you hear them? Can you hear her, guys? No? No. 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 No, I can't. We cannot hear you, and I want to hear you. I want to listen to you. <laughs> Don't worry, Adela. Just fix it. Try to double check what happened. And uh, let me ask somebody else, okay? Don't worry. Take your time. No rush. Roxy, now that you spoke. Hey, Roxy, how are you? <laughs> hey, Roxy, how was your weekend, by the way? Tell us. Um, it was great because mm -hmm. I I went to the beach. Oh, so you went, friends. but no with Ronald, right? No. Ah, okay, it was, it was alone. Okay, cool. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just asking. I went to the beach and I mm -hmm. ate um, shrimp, creams or shrimps. I don't know. How do you say Cameroon? Shrimps? Shrimps. Really? You prepare them or you bought no, them? No, I buy. I bought. You bought them. Okay, it was a cocktail, by the way. You grilled them. How do you prepare uh, it? Cocktail, yes. Oh my goodness, that was amazing. Mm, okay, what else did you do? Um, at Friday, I visit my friend. Mm -hmm. That she had a baby. <gasps> really? Yes. A newborn three, baby? Um, three weeks ago. Oh my God, a newborn baby, almost one month. It was, it's going to be really oh, pretty cute, yes. right? Oh yes, he's my first friend that have a that have a baby. That has a baby. Oh, that's nice. Yes, he's my first. Friend. Oh, I like. They are really nice, right? They're really cute, but at the same time, oh, you need to be very careful. Yes, and he's very quiet. Yes, of course. Yes, most of the time when they are really uh, baby borms, they they have, they had to sleep a lot. They sleep most of the time. Yes. Yeah. Oh, that's that so my weekend. <laughs> that was really nice. Let's hear Wendy. Hi, Wendy. How are you? Hey, tell us Hi. how was your weekend? It was really busy because I have to work in my house. Mm -hmm. And right now, the company are start, started with some events okay. for another another company so okay. i have to organize it and send all the drivers and mm. technicians to the montage and okay. take everything prepare everything yeah and everything was okay oh that's great so everything went fine at the end phew yes that yes, was because, a lot of work to do actually right yes because we have events in san vicente Ooh, in San Vicente. Wow, that was yes. so far away. Oh, it was really hot, by the way. Oof. Yes, it was really tired for, mm -hmm. for him. Mm -hmm. I can't imagine that, yes. But everything went fine, so that's amazing. That's great. I'm so yeah. happy. Uh, what else did you do? Just uh, events or you did something else? And the company... Well, do a lot of things because I yes. am in, in the mm -hmm. events area and the also event. I mm -hmm. sell medic supplies. Ah, okay. Oh, oh really? Medic supplies? Yes. Ooh, that's <laughs> like amazing. a face mask, like um, a face, I don't know what, um, 
what is the meaning of uh, gloves? Gloves, mask. Gloves, uh, face mask, face shield, mm -hmm. and um, thermometers. Thermometer? Thermometer? Mm -hmm. yes. Oh, that's All nice. Those kind of things. That's amazing. And you know what? They're really useful. Nowadays, um, there are some things that have been uh, improved the way that we use them. And they're really nice and new things that we are learning how to use it, especially for communication. And also as well for, um, in this case, like you said, protect our health, right? Okay. Yes. Very good. Guys, thank you so much. Okay, everybody will participate. But I will stop asking you right now, what did you do on weekend? Because I, I want to uh, talk about something really interesting, actually. Okay. You know, um, by the way, what am I wearing? What am I using to give in classes? A headset. A headset. Yes, exactly. A headset. I use a headset to give classes. Okay. Headsets are using for giving classes. Is there a difference of what I said? No? Plural? Plural? No. Uh, do it's I mean the, the same? Gerund. Yay! Who said that? It's the German. Carlos. It's me. It's my... Oh, excuse me, Ismail. May I apologize? <laughs> if you got a, like a similar tone of voice. Yes, actually, yes. Okay, today, guys, basically, we're going to learn how to express um, what is the use of things, for example. And we're going to use two things. The infinitive and the gerund. Actually, if you use either or, the meaning is not going to be different. What is going to be the difference is the structure, okay? For example, remember the first sentence that I said? I used the headset to give classes, right? That is infinitive, to give. Infinitive is always a structure with to plus the simple form of the verb, okay? To give classes. But I can, I can say exactly the same thing with Jaren. Uh, headsets are used for giving classes. What is the difference that I use for instead of two? And I use the ing because I'm using Jaren's, okay? So basically, we're going to talk about this right now. It will be really easy. Don't complicate it. It will be really, really easy. Okay? Let me give you right now the information. Then we're going to practice. Okay? Today is going to be speak, 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 speak. So what do you think? Would you like to speak or speak? Ah, speak. Uh, Helen said speak. <laughs> Melvin, speak. Okay, that's amazing. So we're going to speak. Definitely. Yes. Don't worry, Patty. I know that you have a sore throat problem, so I will take you into consideration, okay? But not much, right, Mercy? Mercy! Hey! Hi! Hi. <laughs> okay, I use the headsets to give classes. But what about you? What are, why are you using your headsets today? I use my headset to receive my classes. To receive, to receive my classes. Okay, you see? Infinitive, to receive, okay? To listen to the teacher, right? Papi, why, okay, you are not using headsets. What are you using? Uh-huh, how do you call that, guys? What is she using? Okay. Uh -huh. She put it, she put it not over her head like me. She put it inside her ear. So inside her. So how do you call that? Uh-huh. Earphones. Exactly. Yeah. Earphones. Okay. Ear, ear, like your ear. Earphone. Earphone, exactly. Because you put it inside. In this one, you put it over your head. So that's why they call yeah, headsets. Okay, so tell me, Patty, why are you using your earphones to listen? To listen, you see, guys, infinitive, to listen to the teacher. 
Okay? okay? You are giving me the reason why you are using this technology device, okay? You are giving me the reason. And you are using infinitive. Okay, let me share right now my screen with you guys. Then we will continue practicing, okay? Is it good? Okay, cool. Let the body start. <laughs> <laughs> All righty. Very good. Now, me just one moment. Let me share my screen. Okay, this is good. Excellent. All right. There you go. Woohoo. Tell me as long as you're able to see my screen, guys, please. Describe how Yes, teacher. Yeah, very good. Exactly. What is the topic for today, uh, Fernando? Describe how something is used. Uh -huh. Describe how something is used. With what, Fernando? What With we're infinity going to... and uh -huh. gerunds. And gerunds, exactly, guys. We're going to uh, know or to, to learn the use of infinitives and the use of gerunds. When would you like to describe what is the reason you use one thing, okay? So let's continue. Okay, guys, let me give you an example, but I want you to focus, first of all, to this part, okay, to the infinitives. Um, read for me the first sentence, if you don't mind, Noemi. Thank you, Noemi. Yeah, I'm listening to you. I use, use my computer to send emails. All righty, okay. The reason why you use the computer is because to send emails okay mm. yes there's another reason why you use a computer um carlos could you please be so kind to let me know the other reason why you use a computer read the second uh, sentence please okay teacher uh computer often used to pay bills exactly so there's another reason why you use computer and what is the reason to pay bills you see exactly take a look at these guys Woohoo! To pay bills. All right. Do you know what what we call to send and to pay? Those are called infinitives. What is the structure? Okay. Is to plus the simple form of the verb. Okay. We do. We, you don't con conjugate that. Okay. Just set it in present. To send, to pay. Tell me something, Carlos. Uh, do you have an idea or came up with an idea, another use of computer? Or tell me something. Do you use your computer uh, at your work? Yeah. Uh, yes, maybe to mm -hmm. write, to, oh, yeah. to, to create a report mm -hmm. from accounting. Very good. And, you know. Very good. You see, to, mm -hmm. okay, so Carlos says, I use my computer to what to create a report you see so where is the infinitive here guys to create. The infinitive? yeah exactly to create that's what i have here exactly you see to create that's the infinitive exactly very good job that is easy peasy queasy is that correct guys yes right of course Okay, now I want your eyes here in gerunds, okay? Can you please be so kind to help me reading the first sentence, uh, Daniela? I use my computer for sending emails. All righty. Tell me, guys, if I said, I use my computer to send emails, I use my computer for sending emails, am I saying the same, yes or no? Yes. 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 What is the difference? Yes. Yeah, take a look at this. Now I'm yeah. using, I'm using oh, yeah. the, the gerund. If I use the gerund, I'm not going to use to. I'm going to use the preposition for, okay? And the ing form of the verbs. Okay, there's another uh, sentence why am I using the uh, computer. Melvin, can you please be so kind to read for me the second sentence? Computers are often used for paying bills. Mm -hmm. Computers are often used to pay bills. Computers are often used for paying bills. Am I saying the same thing? Yes or no? Yes. 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 What is the difference? 
that I'm here for paying. Exactly, I'm using gerunds. So remember, with gerunds, this is going to be the formula really quickly. It's going to be for plus the verb plus ing. All right. And guys, when I'm saying I I use my computer to send emails or I use my computers for sending emails, I'm saying exactly the same. The first one I'm using infinitives. The second one is using gerunds, okay? But I'm saying the purpose of why I am use computers, okay? For example, the purpose of Carlos is he used his computer to create a report. What about you, um, Helen? Why or for what do you use your computer? Tell me. For many things. For I many use, things. I Give use me just my one. computer. I use my computer to uh, create and send the reports every day. Okay. About the the bills and the money that I receive. Very good. What about you, Catherine? Tell me a reason why you use uh, a computer. Using gerund, okay? Using a gerund. Okay. I use my computer to communicate with my customer. To communicate with your customer. Now tell me exactly the same thing, but with gerund. With this one, with the second part. Okay. I use my computer for mm -hmm. communicating with my customer. Very good job, excellent, you see? That is easy peasy queasy, right guys? Of course, and you are really smart, so it's easier for you. Okay, tell me guys, is it clear, this topic? Is it clear? Any doubts no. so far? Yes, yes, it's clear. It's clear, okay. If you have any doubts, please let me know, okay? I will be more than glad to stop. Patty, do you understand? Uh, any questions? Yes, okay, that's what I want. Yes, it's true. Okay, that's what I'm happy. Okay, so guys, let's practice. Okay. Okay, so you see, the only thing that changes between infinitive and gerunds, guys, are the structure of the sentence. Remember, with infinitives, two plus the simple form of the verb, and gerunds, four plus verb plus ing. That's it. All right, guys. Okay, and now I'll give it to you right the a brief explanation of the of the structure, the structure to follow. You see two plus verb. And I will give you the example. And who can help me reading? Oh Mercy, help me read this, please. Okay. Uh, with an infinitive a structure mm -hmm. to follow, two plus verb. Uh -huh. Example. I use the cell phone to call my friends. Okay. So what is the purpose? Friends. To call my friends. Very good. Excellent. All right. Tell me, what about this one with Jaren? Help me read it, please. Uh, with Jaren, mm -hmm. formula to follow. Uh, just give me a moment. Because yeah, I not a problem. See that. Yes. Formula to follow mm -hmm. and... Four plus verb plus ing. Mm -hmm. I use my cell phone for calling my friends. All righty. So for calling my friends is the purpose, you see? Am I saying the same? I'm the same. The difference is that to call my friends, I'm using the infinitive. For calling my friends, I'm using the gerund. But is it the same meaning, Mercy? What do you think? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. It's, it's exactly the same meaning. Very good. Okay, guys, let's continue. Okay, so and remember, we use two with infinitive and four with gerunds, okay? That is really important. Okay, now let's practice, okay? Mm. Hey, guys, what is this? What is this? A cell phone. A cell phone, no, okay. Cell phone. But you already have the first image in your head, right? A cell phone. Tell me, uh, Jose Ismael, what do you yes. use a cell phone for? For what? Why you use it? Give me one. Okay. I use. Mm -hmm. I use my cell phone for playing 
games. For playing games, very good. What about you, Umberto? I use my cell phone to talk with my friends. Very good to talk with your friends. What about you, Maria del Carmen? I use my cell phone for receiving my my class, English class. Oh, very good. So now you're using your cell phone, is that correct? Yes. <laughs> very good, thank you. Uh, Adela, what about you? I cannot hear you, sorry. What happened with Adela's phone? Uh, hopefully, yeah. Hello, Adela, no? Okay, let, let's, let's wait. Don't worry about that, okay? Just fix it. Noemi, what about you? Okay, I use my cell phone for testing. For testing, for texting. <laughs> texting. Because testing is like if you're proving something is works. But if you said, uh, but if you want to send messages, it's texting. texting. Exactly. Very good job. Excellent. What about you, Carlos? And when you uh, I use myself for, for joining the conference. For joining the conference, okay. Or if you want to use with uh, the same sentence, but with infinitive, how you say it? I use my cell phone to join the conference. Excellent, very good job. You know what? You make me feel so happy. Yes, <laughs> excellent, very good. Okay, don't think bad, okay, about the heart, okay? I'm just kidding. <laughs> All righty, and Christian, what about you? Give me a, re a reason why you use cell phone. I use my phone the, for watch videos. For watch or for watching? For watch videos. For watch, guys? No, for watching. For watching. For watching. Very good, very okay. good. That's okay, Sorry. Christian. Okay. No, that's okay. Don't worry. Remember that with gerunds, we use for in the ing form of the verb. So it's for okay. watching. Or if you would oh, like okay. to okay. use watch, you said to watch. Oh, right? okay. To watch okay. videos. Very good. Okay, let okay, me give you, you this. My pleasure. The second image, okay? Allow me one moment. Let's go back to business. Woohoo. All right. What about these ones, guys? What is that? It's pencil. It's a pencil. All right. Pencil. Tell me, uh, 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 Mercy, what do you use the pencil for? I use the pencil for writing a letter. For writing a letter. Very good. Or oh, a letter. Very good. Uh, what about you, Catherine? I use the pencil for to what? You use I a pencil too? Use mm -hmm. I use the pencil to do my homework. my homework. To do your homework. Very good job. Excellent. What about you, Roxy? I use my pencil for, um, for take a note. For take a note or for taking notes? What do you for think? taking notes. Very good, excellent. Remember, for with ing form, okay? Gerund, okay? You gotta put for taking, okay? If you want to say to take, you can say to take notes, right? If you're using infinitive. Very yes. good job, excellent. And Wendy, what about you? I use my pen to my write pen, it. My pencil. My pencil. Aha, uh -huh, very good. I use my pencil to write a report. To write a report, very good. And last but no least, uh, 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 uh. Claudi, what about you? I use my I, I use, use my pencil to draw. To draw. To draw. To draw. Very good job. Okay, let me share with you another image that I have here. By the way, all righty. Let me check. All right, what is that, guys? Pen. Ah, uh, yeah, it's a pen. It's a red pen, by the way, right? Okay, so tell me, Umberto, what is the use that you that you do to, or that you give to the red pen or a pen? What do you use it for? Uh, well, I use my pen for killing people, like a joker. 
for killing people like a joker <laughs> okay that's a really strange use of pen right okay very good <laughs> what about you melvin stay away from humberto okay if you if you see that he's using a pen okay <laughs> i use red pen to write my class to write your class okay that is your favorite color by the way okay what about you fernando I use my pen for designing art. Okay, excellent. What about you, Carlos? I use my pens to signing the contract. To signing a contract. Very good. All right. What about you, Jose Ismael? I use my red pens. Sorry, I use my red pen to result. A to text. result? To okay. resolve important text. Do you consider to resolve important text or to highlight a text? To highlight a text. Mm -hmm. Exactly. Very good. Normally mm -hmm. we use a marker, right? We use a marker to highlight it, but that's okay. Very good. Let me show. Let me share with you another image that I have. Okay. Ha, make you think, right? <laughs> that's what I like. That you think, guys. Mm -hmm. All right. I have another one, by the way. Let me check. What about this one? What are they, guys? We we're talking about that. What are they? Headphones. Headsets. 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 Okay. I already said what I'm using the headsets. Okay. But what about you, Christian? Why are you using the headsets for? I am using my headset mm -hmm. for work. For work or for working? Uh, for working, sorry. Very good. That's, that's okay. Excellent. What about you, Melvin? I use my headset to receiving my class. To receive in the class or to receive for the receiving, class? Uh, for, for receiving. receiving. Oh, okay, may I apologize. I heard something else. What about you, Mercy? I use my headset to listen to music to listen to music yay yeah very good what about you adela hopefully i can listen to you <laughs> yeah, that's great excellent i used my headset for yeah for listening my class for listen or for listening listen. yay listen. very good excellent <laughs> excellent job all righty and tell me patty why are you using your earphones I I use it when talk. For, talk for 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 talk for talk or for talking uh, for talking my husband in the night ah for talking with your husband at night okay interesting use and of course <laughs> and of course for paying attention to the teacher right at the English class of course <laughs> yes all right very good excellent okay let me share with you my last image okay bear with me for a moment <laughs> there you go oops teacher you don't you you're not um watching here okay i apologize for that Ooh yes there you go i forgot to share with you all righty guys what about this one what do you see the last one ipad, a iPad or a tablet okay so tell me guys iPad. Yes, tablet right now. Mm -hmm. Tablet. Tablet. Tell me, um, Carlos, do you have a tablet, by the way? Sorry. Uh, yes, I use okay. a tablet. What I for? Use a tablet to take a picture. To take a picture. Okay, very good. What about you, Umberto? I use my tablet to watch movies. To watch the movies. Very good. What about you, Melvin? I use my tablet to see pictures to see picture to, nah, to see to watch or to look at to watch i will i will that will be your hunger okay okay <laughs> thank you yeah what's the difference between look see and watch watch is for movie watch tv Mm -hmm. uh -huh, uh -huh. When you need to pay more attention, you just watch. Uh -huh. that's, that, that's one reason, yes, but don't help me, okay? He needs to study. Uh -huh. <laughs> now, now, don't worry, I will send you that information, okay? Don't worry about that. But that's good. Very good, Melvin. What, good I'm, 
Yeah. Sí. What about you, eh, Jose? I use my tablet to read ebooks. To read ebooks, very good, excellent. What about you, Maria del Carmen? I use my tablet for watching TV. For watching TV series, very good. What about you, Daniela? I use my tablet to look for any information. To look for any information, very good. What about you, Helen? I use a tablet to check my email. To check your email, excellent. What about you, Catherine? I use my table for checking my social network. All right, very good, excellent. What about you, Janet? I use the tab uh, tablet mm -hmm. to watch videos. To watch videos, very good. What about you, Noemi? I use my tablet to play. To play? <laughs> yeah. yeah, me too. <laughs> no, in this case, for study. Yes, for me to study. Yeah. Hey, what about you, Fernando? You, I think you you use your tablet for different things, right? Yeah. In my, in my, <laughs> in my case, is 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 on a Noemi. I use my tablet for playing video game. Video for game. Playing video games. Oh, really? Yes. Yes, teacher. <laughs> okay, only for that. Come on. Okay, that's okay. Okay, guys. No, maybe maybe because all the people said the others use. Uh huh. Exactly. Okay, I have you know what some things that they you, that will make you think. Okay, <laughs> and I will send it to you right now through the chat. So allow me just a couple of minutes. All righty, let me share it right now with you. This Peter. Yes, girl. I have a question. Do I go ahead? I'll listen to you. We are going to use the two forms to yes. uh, in every uh, all the time, or you can use uh, either or. Uh, either all or. The time. Yes, yes. Most of the time, when you would like to express what is the reason or for you use this or, the, or that, you will need to use or either infinitive or Jerry. Ah, okay. Thank but do you. me a favor, make the question again. We are going to use or are we going to use? Are we going to exactly. use? Exactly. Remember, Sorry. that is a yes, no question. So very good. Yes. Excellent job. All righty. Okay, guys, very good. Okay, Adela, you have problems with your cell phone, you said? Okay, don't worry. I'm going to send you an information through the WhatsApp, okay? Oh, no. No, it's not necessary. Let me put it right now on the chat. <laughs> I want you guys to, to think. Yeah. Okay. All right. The first thing, guys, that I want to know, if you can give me an answer. Um, I want to know why or, yes, or what is the reason or why uh, satellites are used? Tell me. What about satellites? Hmm? Are used? Uh-huh, what about satellites? What do you think, size? What is the purpose of using satellite satellites? Any ideas? For the communication? For communicating. Uh, communicating. For communicating. Okay. Communicating, double M. Communicating, what else? Another reason why we use satellites, guys, for communicating. What else? Think about it. Ha, huh, make you think, right? Uh -huh. Tom Cruise used to film the movie. To film movies, okay. Yeah. <laughs> to film, it's true. yeah, it's true. to film movies. All right, what else? There's another purpose of why we use satellite, guys. Any other idea? No? Mr. Fernando Munero. Satellite, satellite, satellite. Okay, thank you. You're welcome, Catherine. 
Ajá. Uh -huh. That is hard, right? That is hard to think. Ajá. Uh -huh. Okay, let me share with you another one. Mm -hmm. Okay. Now, let me check really quickly. Okay. What about these ones? Mm -hmm. Okay, what about robots? Robots sometimes are used for? For? Robots. For killing people. For killing people, yeah, yeah. For killing people. Okay, yeah, yes, that might be. Uh, to build uh, cars. To what? To build a car. To build. See, si, a car. To build cars, all right. Yes, especially, right, Mercedes Benz, right, Toyota and all those stuff. Mm -hmm. All right, what else? To resolve a problem. To resolve a problem, all right. What else? Mm-hmm. What else? Robots. What do you think, guys? For help the people. To help people. Very good. To help people. All right. Anything else? For making an activities. To make an activities? For making. For making an activity. For making an activities. All right. Uh-huh. What else? And activities, no, for making, for making some activities. If you want to use an, you have to, it will be in singular, an activity, if it's more than one, some activities, okay? Okay, thank you. You're welcome, very good. What else? Any other idea, guys? For purpose of robots, no? For experiment. For experiment, for experiment or for experimenting? Or to experiment. experimenting. Yes, or ex <laughs> experimenting. There you go, excellent. All right, what about, let me give you another option here really quickly. Ah, this is going to be interesting. Okay, now about you people, that you are really technology girls and men, right? People use internet for Okay, people use internet for? Uh -huh. For what? For selling. For what? I cannot hear you, Catherine. Sorry to apologize. You were cutting off. Okay, for selling products. For selling. Very good for selling products. Excellent. To what else, guys? Information. To search. to search information. To search information. Very good job. What else? To communicate. To communicate. Very good. What else? To learn. To learn. Very good. What else, guys? To share information. To share, you said? Yes. To information. share information. All righty. To share information. What else? For reading. For reading, excellent job. What else, guys? For making for creating, what page? For making, for making or creating, right? For making friends. Oh, for making friends, ah, yes. For making friends, and you said, uh, Fernando, for creating web pages, right? For creating right? web page, yes. Okay, for creating, all right, wait a minute, wait. Okay. creating web pages. All righty, what else? Or learning for what? Sorry. Social net networks. For uh, okay. For social network. Use for checking. Ah. For checking social net. All right, social okay. network. Very good, right? Like Twitter, right? Facebook, Hangouts, etc. Right? Okay, very good. So you see, this one is a little bit easy, right? Because you are a technology man and a technology woman. All right, very good. Mm, let me check another one. <laughs> ah, <laughs> this one's not going to be a really easy. Aha, uh -huh, but but you are really smart. Okay, a GPS device is used to locate. To to what? Locate. To locate. To locate something, right? Yeah. Oh, to locate something. Okay. 
No, someone, something. Okay. What? Up, what? Anything else? Okay. For look for looking for my girlfriend. For looking somebody. <laughs> you okay? So you insert a cheap word. Okay. <laughs> okay. I maybe you know what? No, may, I don't. I don't know if they already invent a at that we can insert a chip to a human being, but we can insert a chip to a pet, right? For dog or cats, right? Remember? Okay, if your dog and your cat first, maybe they got lost, so you can look for your pet, right? For looking pets, okay? For looking at pets, very good, what else? No girlfriend or bad To send a address. To what? To, to, find, to, to, find, find, or, or, to find out an address. Okay, to find out an address. Very good. All right, to mm. find out or to look for an address. Oh, very good. To look for. To look for an address. All right, very good. Mm -hmm. What else? Uh, for finding device stalling. Okay, for finding, finding, you said, right? For yes. finding a stolen Device. devices. Stolen devices, remember that in English, first is an adjective and then the noun. In Spanish, it's the opposite way, right? In Spanish, it's stolen devices. Uh, sorry, it's no, it's uh, devices stolen, sorry. But in English, it's stolen devices. Okay, ah, mm -hmm. anything else? Yes. Hey, re remember, you want to go, for example, to a specific place, right? But there's a lot of traffic. So you use the GPS also to find a better route, right? Yes. Mm -hmm. To find a better Waste. route. Why is it like Waze. it works like a oh. EPS, right? To so avoid the traffic. Yeah, to avoid, exactly, to avoid traffic. Or Google Maps. Exactly. Or for finding a better, right? A better route. Is that correct? Mm -hmm. Better route. There you go. Excellent. And the last one I have here, let me check really quickly. Mm -hmm -hmm. Ah, ah, this is easy because we already have um, talked about that. Okay, what about this one? A tablet computer can use for, again? Mm -hmm. For reading a newspapers? Ah, mm -hmm. For reading, for reading newspapers. To receive uh, a order. To receive, to receive what? A uh, orders. An order. Oh, oh yes. to receive orders, orders. Yes. Yes, to receive orders, yes. What else? Mm -hmm. hey. To do my homework. To do your, <laughs> excellent, very good, Naomi. To do my homework. What else? For receiving class. For receiving, class. yes, for receiving class. Receiving class or receiving classes. There you go. All righty, very good, excellent. Also, for example, Helen. Helen, you can use a tablet to book, to book clients. You see? Exactly. To book, to book, to book right. clients. To make a reservation, okay? It could be um, hotel reservation, restaurant reservation, uh, airline reservation, right? Whatever. Mm -hmm. What else? To save to, important information. To save, uh, yeah, to save important information. Uh -huh. To say hi to you, somebody, right? Yeah, like me. Hi. To say yeah. what? To say yeah, hi. Video conference. Uh huh. To somebody. To to be in a conference, yeah. To be in to a send email conference, yeah. To send an email. There you go. An email. It is. Dash. There you go. An email. Very good. Mm hmm. What else? To use a bank application. To use a bank application. Uh, also, you can say to pay some bills, right? To pay bills. Yeah. If you're if you use your e-bank account, 
-hmm. to to make some transactions right to make some transactions right very good what else any other idea oh that's it to make a sign to make a sign electronic sign ah yes mm -hmm. electronic sign Ooh mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. very good what else any other idea okay that's good for listening uh, podcast for listening or for watching listening for listening podcast. For listening po podcast, you said? Like that? Yeah. Okay. And also for watching a broadcast as well. Very good. Excellent. You see, we have practiced the use of infinitive and gerunds. We would like to express how you use or what is the purpose of you use, for example, cell phone, headsets, earphones. What else? Mouse, right? Except. Hands, for example. Okay. Now, guys, I want you, that is going to be your homework for tomorrow because time is over. Can you imagine? Time passed really fast. Oh, my goodness. I don't know, but I, I, I didn't feel the time. Okay, so I will need a one use. You can, you, you can um, either use the infinitive or the gerund. That will be okay for me. One use that you can give to your hands. All right. One use that you can give to your head. One use that you can give to, uh, what else? To a pillow. <laughs> All right. And one use that you can give to, uh, 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 to your tongue. Tongue. Tongo, tongo. Tongo or tongo. 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 Okay. So one use that you can give to your hands, one use that you can give to your brain, one use that you can give to your tongo mm -hmm. and mm -hmm. to your pillow. Okay? That's it. That will be all. Okay? Don't worry. I have more, but that's okay. With only four, you're fine, right? Sorry, teacher, I didn't listen to the 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 activity or the homework? Okay, the homework will be that I want you to give me a sentence, either use uh, infinitive or gerunds, and you need to let me know the purpose of why you use tongue, mm -hmm. head, hands, and pillow. Okay? Okay. One use thank for you. each of them. Yes, my pleasure. Okay, thank you. Any questions right now, guys? Any doubts? Feel free. I'm here to help you. Anything else you want to know? Yeah? No? No. 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 Okay. Okay, guys. So, see you tomorrow. Hugs and kisses. Have a great night and great meal. Okay? Bye-bye. Bye. 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 Bye.